Hello everyone, สบายดีพี่น้อง Today I'm making s o m u or fermented grounded pork. This time I will be using nam powder to help preserve the pork. สบายดีพี่น้องมื้อนี้แม่บ้านสิพามาเห็ดสมมูอีกเนาะแต่ว่าเธอนี่แม่บ้านสิใส่ผงแหนมหลายขึ้นกว่าเก่าเนาะแต่ก็ยังบอลายเพียงพอแต่ว่าลายขึ้นกว่าเก่านังที่เขาซื้อมากเอามาต้มด้วยพี่น้องต้มแล้วก็ต้องน้ำออกให้มันแห้งเนาะให้มันเสด็จน้ำสะก่อนจังเอามาใส่ The big sheets of pork skin are store bought. I boil it with the whole thing with fat and everything. Then I'm gonna work my way like this one right here. I clean out all the fat, just shave out all the fat and slice them thin. So I try my best to slice as thin as I could, and this store bought one is extra extra long, so I cut them down to make them short. Also, the cooked jasmine rice must be cooled down, no more steam. And then we're gonna pound two whole garlics. Remove all the skins. We pound it down really well, and then it's easier to remove the skins after you pounded them. After I pounded the whole cloves of garlics, I peel them out. They come out very easy. Now I'm chopping the garlics. Chop them into like little pieces like this. Preheat the pan and add about half cup of vegetable oil. Add in all the chopped garlics. Pan fried until they are golden. Then drain really well and let it cool first. Now drain the garlics and let it cool down first before use. Make sure you slice the meat to bite sides so it is easier on the food processor. Here I have two whole cloves of garlics. You can peel and cut them in half. One cup cooked jasmine rice, and all these pork skins are cooked, sliced, and air dried. Make sure the fried garlics are well cooled. ปะกระเทียมเจียวให้มันเย็นด้วยพี่น้อง Grind rice, garlics, and the fried garlics. Food processor don't need to be washed. We can just add the sliced pork in that same food processor and grind everything down. If you see any more water on the meat, you must pat them dry with paper towel. That helps the fermented pork not to be rotted. Here I have um, pink grounded pork and brown. The reason they are brown is because I add too much meat in one batch. You need to do a little bit at a time or half of the food processor. Fill it up with half and grind a little bit at a time. Put. Everything in a large mixing bowl. Here I have three tablespoons sugar. I am using only two packages of nam powder for six pounds of ground pork. It is supposed to be one packet per kilo. One kilo is equal two point two pounds. The reason I only use two packages of nam powder is because I would like to avoid preservative. This nam powder contains preservative, and I like mine to be a bit natural. I add five tablespoon of sea salt. Make sure they are sea salt, not iodine salt. Iodine salt will make it rot. The nam packet came with at least one tablespoon salt, and I use all that as well. Followed by that, I use two tablespoon MSG. Continue with massage or mix until it forms a sticky paste. Now add the shredded pork skin. And continue mixing until it forms a sticky paste. เอาหนังลงไปแล้วก็คั่นต่อไปด้วยพี่น้องจนมันเหนียวคุณละ When I got that sticky consistency, I form it into an oval shape, kind of like a small loaf of bread. Bo fao tat thea pinong. Bo fao dung 
บกพอตัดน้อยไม่จะดึงออกมาแล้วกันมันจังแหนนค่ะมันจังห่องามเนาะ kind of squeeze and make it kind of over a little bit kind of long like a, a loaf of bread okay I'm adding some chili peppers put some red one in here to add some colors some garlics now I'm gonna roll let me get some tape ready because When I roll, it's really hard for me to get the to pull the tape and trying to hold that. Squeeze and pull. Squeeze and pull. Now cut. Tap มันพี่น้อง Beep, lom or no? Beep, lom or like a king, king, king. Ani, man, pen pen yang, nieu, noi, nen, pen nong. Man, king, sabai, no? Oh, it accidentally sticks on there already. And then, king, man, hai man, nen, pi nong, nen ba. King, hai man, nen, no. Ro, kong me ban, man, man, nen, lem, jam mod, la no, te ba, man, bao, na. Hao ke, tong kan, hai man, pen, hai man, na, nit, nen, hai man, yang nat, no, man, jeng, jeng, dai, sa ba. Kind of squeeze it in a little bit over, and then add some peppers. Fresh chili peppers. Some fresh garlics. When it turns sour, um, we eat the garlic and the peppers along with the uh, fermented pork. That's the whole purpose of the peppers, like that. Kind of squeeze, squeeze as you go. Squeeze like that, pull it, make it long. Okay, so it's already long. I'm gonna cut. So when I get to my point that I wanna, and then I cut, and try to pull the saran wrap a little bit straight out, and then squeeze out the air. Squeeze as you go, and then roll. Roll. So it's tight now, and then you just kind of hold that, and then get the tape. And then kind of press so it's tight and it stays intact. 